that the cloud infrastructure has that Mongo database, the connection string is in Key Vault, and the Key Vault endpoint and secret name are in the container app environment, I need to go get that connection string and be able to use it in my code. So when I'm dealing with Azure, generally speaking, I stick any Azure specific SDK code into its own folder and I have uh, the file named with the service name so that it's pretty easy to track what's going on. In this file, I'm just getting a secret from Key Vault, and as long as I have the endpoint and the secret name, that should work. All of the permissions that the application needs to actually authenticate and authorize to Key Vault have already been done in the infrastructure, so all my code has to do is actually go read it. Um, in order to add that connection string back into the startup code for the application, I already had some connection uh, code provided. So once I know if I need to go get something from MongoDB, I can call in to get the connection string. That connection string function needs to determine is it a local or cloud database connection string that it needs, and then it returns it. And at that point, um, the application has all of it, all of what it needs to connect to the cloud database. It has a connection string. Uh, 